What up, you guys? Yo, check out this quote by Neville Goddard. He says, for others only echo that which we whisper to them in secret. Let me say it again. Others only echo that which we whisper to them in secret. Now, if you're not sure what that means, listen to this Neville story that might sound so trippy to some of you that once you hear it, you might be like, is that really possible? Can you really change reality like that? And I'm telling you, yeah, <laughs> doing this can literally change your world just like that. It's wild, dude, so listen up. Here's what happened. One day, a costume designer described to Neville how hard it was working with a prominent theatrical producer. And she was convinced that he unjustly criticized and rejected her best work and was often straight up rude and unfair to her. But here's what's interesting. As Neville was hearing her story, he explained that if she found the other person rude and unfair, it was a sure sign that she herself, not the producer, was in need of a new attitude. And you might be like, what? You see, Neville told her that through this power called the law of assumption, all she had to do was assume that the situation was already what she wanted it to be, which would then, believe it or not, bring about the desired change. Why? Here's the eye opener. Her employer was only bearing witness, telling her by his behavior, listen, what her concept of him was, what her concept of him was. Neville pointed out that she was probably having conversations with him in her mind, which were filled with criticism and accusations. And sure enough, he was right. <laughs> she was mentally arguing with the producer. In fact, she confessed that every morning on her way to the theater, she told him just what she thought of him in a way she'd never say to his face. And because of that, the intensity and force of her mental arguments with him automatically established his behavior towards her. So what she do after she realized this? What was her solution? Here's a secret. Ready? She changed her attitude. That's it. She changed her attitude and agreed to live this law faithfully by assuming that she was satisfied with her job and that her relationship with the producer was a very happy one. Here's how she did it. Before going to sleep at night and on her way to work, and at different times during the day, she would imagine that her employer, the producer, had congratulated her on her fine designs and that she, in turn, had thanked them for his praise and kindness. Then guess what? That's what happened. His behavior miraculously reversed itself, where his attitude, echoing as it had always done, that which he assumed, now reflected her changed concept of him. In other words, by the power of her imagination, you guys, her persistent assumption. She influenced his behavior and determined his attitude towards her. Boom. Sounds hard to believe? Look, it's all good if you're skeptical. You want to know if this works? Try this. That's the best way to find out for yourself. You know what I'm saying? Try this with your family, your friends, coworkers, whoever, whatever your situation is. If there's stuff going on that you don't want or you heard something that you don't want to hear, then flip it to what you do want, to what you do want to hear, and feel its reality. Then see what happens. Seriously. I've tested this. Shoot, even several times this past week, I've seen this work. It's dope. Where people said things to me, things I didn't want to hear, but then I changed my attitude, the inner talking in my head, to what I did want to hear. Then bam, within minutes, they got back to me telling me exactly what I wanted to hear. No joke. Several times this past week, dude, with different people. And on one occasion, someone was like, Josh, how'd you do that? They're so strict here. Teach me your tips. For others only echo that which we whisper to them in secret. Folks, don't forget, we live in an assumptive world, meaning your assumptions, your expectations determine your reality. You don't got to worry about anyone or anything. You change your attitude, your inner talking, you change your world. You get what you believe. Yeah. Alrighty, guys, don't forget to smash that like and subscribe button to help support this channel and the bell right next to it to be notified of my next video. I pump these out every single week so you don't want to miss them. If you're listening via podcast, I'd really appreciate a review. It gets more people to discover my work and, of course, help spread this message. And yo, don't forget to register for my free online training that'll seriously help you to start manifesting the life you really want right now. So check it out. Links in the description. Like I always say, more's coming. Till next time, I'm out. Peace.